when that ball lightning is going to be behind him. That's the hardest part of a storm game is just not getting ganked in lane. So the fact that he made the choice to go uh, sit back, not play risky in the mid, is really going to benefit. Oh god, up top, Puck drops the base. Oh, is able to take up the, the Batrider. Though. SVG. Oh, he's going at it though. He's just out of juice. He's got the impale. You got to budget it carefully. That level like, five. Not even common. It's That's so how close. Is. SVG. He's so hesitant. If he drops that impale, he knows it's over. But the rest of his team is coming in. He wants to go. He wants to finish off the storm spear, but he's not able to do so. The Nyx assassin is the one that ends up eating it there. One punch from the ogre oh, no. will secure the kill. So that was a bit of a turnaround. I think Nyx just spent a little bit. Yeah, Batriders he picks up the arcane boots and isn't going to be grabbing any components of the drums just yet. So a little bit of an interesting build for the Batrider so far. Bottom lane, we got Drow Ranger into a corner. Another Dream Coil being dropped. It's Dream Coil on lasso action, but King Tekka wins out again in the end. Yeah, this is the uh, the one thing about the NP draft. It's just like, whew. Poor MSS. Oh, that's a hasted envy, though. Oh, yeah. The dream is the razor. He's chasing you up. There's going to be the gust, but it's not enough to break the link. There is going to be that stun coming back out onto Envy. The Illuminate comes through. Won't connect with any of the Radiant Heroes, but there's going to be that plasma field. Envy kills off the Drow Ranger, and he's looking for more. He's got crazy damage. They lose the Keeper of the Light. Now, Envy could be in a little bit of trouble here. He bit off more than he could chew as the Puck comes in. The Storm Spirit comes in. There's a nice Impale connecting onto three once again. And I think the fight might be early Radiance builds. Nothing too crazy there. Envy? Meanwhile, mid lane, Mid Envy. Uh, he just wants to defend here. There's going to be that silence off onto the Nyx Assassin. Can Nyx save the day? Razor goes down. They are able to trade for a Storm Spirit. There's going to be a Lasso connecting onto Excel. They lose the Vengeful Spirit, and they want to go for more here. Ben Jazz is going to get clipped by the Illuminate, but it's not going to be enough now. Nyx Assassin caught up in the Dream Coil. Batrider next in the menu. Will they finish him off, or will he get to the high ground? He is going to be hit by that Ben Jazz arrow. Puck able to dodge out that one click, but the Illuminate oh, wow. not quite enough to finish him off. He's able to Dream Coil, or rather, uh, Illusory Orb himself back to safety. Those treads paying off right there. Yeah, oh my god! Go brown boots veil. The strength treads and the illuminate. <laughs> oh boy! Um, but either way, that was a pretty bloody fight for nine minutes into the game. Five heroes drop. And the oh that arcane rune. Oh, that's gonna feel good. But will it be enough to save his life? He's able to get off that one last Q, but it looks like he will still end up falling. Storm Spirit feeling really good about that pick. Now three, one, and three. He's already got a thousand. Like this game, he's got the arcane boots for that nice little, like, later on the Octarine and whatnot, but. Envy. I don't think he gets out of this one here. <laughs> His team is nowhere nearby to bail him out. So, nice, easy pick once again, going the way of the puck. And Puck didn't have to drop that Dream Coil. So. Alright, so King Tekka just going forward really aggressively onto this Keeper of the Light, dropping the Dream Coil for a solo pickoff. I mean, it's expensive, but it is certainly worthwhile showing off that fancy new Blink Dagger and this tier. So we're going to have a smoke up behind the Roche Pit, looking like they're going up onto the high ground. They will find Envy. Oh, poor little Razor. Uh, he was not expecting that at all. This Radiant Vision uh, up near the right. I assume you just give him a storm here. Oh, hero. oh, MSS oh, God, Pat Rider tried so hard. But unfortunately, but he didn't get so far. He did not get that far. Now SVG hits a nice, another triple man impale. Does lose his life in the back lands. Envy will find a kill. He does pick up the ventral speed. He's looking for more, but his own life might be in danger. He's dream coiled up. He wants to finish off the storm Yo, spirit. Will pop the ages, but Envy does end up dropping. That's really unfortunate for him. Uh, so it is going to be a three for one trade and the Aegis, but still a great fight for Infamous, and they're just exerting their pressure now, exerting pop as they get a little bit closer to this Bat Rider. They're crawling up the hill. They will be able to find him just obliterated there. Dagon, three now on to the puck. He can afford to pick up another level. There's the raindrop still on the stairs. Will Storm Spirit be merciful this time? Damn, dude. Yeah. That was long range. I, he's, he's got the Naga to try and bring you on back. They, they've got to go now. It's now or never. They're All looking right. to initiate. They bring in everyone. This is a good position to fight for NP, but the Storm Spirit just goes in, drops it. They pick up the Keeper of the Light of the back lines. They're looking to go into Envy here, and they get the blast here. Penjash just wailing away at him. This might be it, as there's going to be gems on the deck. They lose the Puck. They lose the Venge, but they do get down the Razor. There will be Ooh, the Lasso nice. here on the Ogre. Storm Spirit, he's still up. He's got a decent amount of mana, but not going to stop and save his buddy instead. Just leap into freedom, one bottle sip at a time. So in the end, NP have a very, very effective hold, losing power without ever exposing herself to tower shots or any sort of damage or vulnerability. So all of NP grouping up onto this high ground. Rest in peace, Batrider.
Now there's going to be a nice little impale. King Tekka could be in some trouble here. He's still got the Dream Quill. Going to be going in to get the silence off onto Eternal Envy. And they get the dip in onto Aoi. And they kill off the Naga. There's a gem on the deck. And this may be it as Razor goes down with no buyback to be found. It's a godlike streak. An ultra kill out for Kataro on the Storm Spirit. He was double damaged the entire time. And he should be able to get away. He's now going to be stuck up here. Unfortunately, not zipping far enough away charges. from the fight. Oh god, yeah, he's getting mana like, whoa, 42 reach him on his bloodstone right now. And they got toyed SEO. Oh. oh god. That's gotta just hurt you on the inside. That was disgusting. That was actually filthy. Fire Blast off Ogre Magi. He's tanky, but he's not gonna be uh, able to stand up to five heroes of Dream Coil comes in! Three heroes! Oh god, the Naga goes down again! They pick off the bat, and Coddle is gonna be following, so it's gonna be GG called out at 31 minutes. Infamous! looking incredibly strong starting out this best of three series. Yeah, that was a really nice variation on the Drow lineup.